it's not a walkthrough, playthrough, review, anything like that. It's just me playing the game badly, so you can see what it looks like. Right then, this is Invaders by DKtronics on the Sinclair Spectrum. Oh my, oops. So obviously it's a Space Invaders clone. It's quite speedy. Um, oh, it's not visually. It's not not adhering to what you would expect Space Invaders to look like in terms of the shapes of the invaders, but actual gameplay-wise, yeah, I guess so. Um, I'm not finding it. Oh, they actually have got legs, or not? I don't know. The the. Hmm. I guess that's when they're putting their they're putting their legs together, and they appear not to have legs. That sounds kind of wrong, actually. Um, I'm just watching how they move. Like do they they move in rows, not individually. I can't remember how uh, how actual invaders works. I see some invaders clones, and they all move like in a massive, great big block, the whole lot all at once. This they're moving in rows. It seems a little. No, they are going in a sort of orderly manner. It's quite speedy. Looking at the speed of the the, the missiles and that alien, the, the the saucer at the oh god, the saucer at the top. It's quite speedy. Um, I don't want to play anymore though. I like space invaders, but I like real space invaders, and this just isn't. I mean, it's just, it, it, it's an invaders clone. It's adequate. It's reasonably competent. Like, it's not shoddily programmed. It's lacking in character, and it doesn't make me want to play. So, I'm not going to. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Yes, your majesty, it would be... What, what the bloody hell? Okay, which smart-ass rig to subscribe button to the teleporter?